Hi folks, this is Mike with Eminem Precision Painting and today we're going to show you how to clean paint brushes and rollers out in your sink because sometimes it's 22 degrees outside and you don't want to be playing around. So first thing you want to do is get your old or your paint can, the can with your paint in it. And we'll pop it off as such. Pull that to the side. You're going to need a 5-in-1. 5-in-1. Uh, wire brush. And I'll show you guys how, just how fast this is. You're going to take your roller. You're going to take your 5-in-1. And you're going to get the excess paint off the roller just like this. Bada bing. You'd be surprised how much these rollers hold. That's money. Alright. I'm going to do that. Set your roller in your sink for now. Get your brush. Make sure you wipe the excess paint off this. Well, before you do that, make sure... You want to get all that old paint from the paint you were using back in this bucket. Most of it anyways. Kind of like that. Alright, now that you got that, there you go. Put your roller over here. Now put some water in your paint can. Rinsed out really well. Need a rag, it works a little faster. You want to do this until the can, uh, until the water is clean. Fill it about halfway. <clears throat> and then you're going to take the paintbrush. Go ahead and put the lid back on this guy. Now you're going to take your paintbrush and you're going to do this up and down motion. So that you get the water deep up in the ferrule, any paint might be in there. Then you're going to do a side to side, kind of like this in the bottom of the can, like this number. And you're going to alternate between the two. A little dip, side to side, dip, side to side. Then you're going to take it out, you're going to rest it right here, take your wire brush to get any of this dry paint off your bristles while so it's coming off. Start dipping side to side, side to side, dump it, and clean water again. And you're going to want to do this until the uh, the water that you're dipping the brush in is quite clear, or close to it at least. Really close.
and as you guys can probably see, that water's pretty clean. So there's probably not a whole lot of paint, if any, on this brush. So now you're just gonna squeeze it out a little bit and set this guy aside. Knock it on your side like that. Don't do it too hard or you'll break your brush. So you do that. And you wanna reform it and set it aside. And there's your paintbrush. Now I'll show you guys how to clean the roller. Take it off the cage, frame, slide it around like this, that water is that. Don't forget the inside. You don't want any paint left in there. Another way to do it is you can leave it alone, set it like that, and just let it run over. I don't have time for that though, so. Anyhow, kind of like that. Now you just want to get it to where it's pretty clear. And you can do this with a larger roller too, but I suggest doing it maybe in the bathtub. And if you don't have a bathtub or a shower, or you can go to the YMCA. Truck stop maybe? All right, so. Public restroom. After you get that cleaned out pretty good, so you decide to make sure your roller frame is cleaned out good. Get all the paint off. Now, okay, if you got a sink like mine, you can do one of these where it can just get away. Spin it out like this. Mm -hmm. Or if you don't, don't have one like this. You can just manually stick it down in here. Just spin it out with your hand. And that's it. Now you got a clean brush and a clean roller. All right, folks, thanks for watching. And uh, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And stay tuned for, don't forget to follow us on Instagram, Facebook, and subscribe to the YouTube channel. And yeah, that's it. And we'll see you next time. Have a good one.